What is going on guys, or should I say, what is going on comrades, it's Jack Girls 1875 here. Today I've got a very special Eastern Block mystery shirt unboxing. Now before I jump in explaining how this is going to work, I'd like to thank Surprise Shirt Co for making this video possible. Now this isn't a paid advertisement or anything like that, I did pay for these. But I just want to thank them because they've been absolutely amazing. As soon as they found out I'd be doing it for my YouTube, they were really, really helpful. And it's a bit of a niche thing, you know, an Eastern Block unboxing. It's a bit of a niche thing to sort of get requested. So they've been really, really helpful. Moved heaven and earth to get these shirts out to me. Keep me updated every single step of the way. So please consider buying from them. These are really decently priced boxes and you just don't know what you're going to get. I've seen people getting shirts from Thailand, Africa. It's absolutely amazing. It's something that you don't expect. Now, obviously, I've done German football unboxings here on the channel numerous times. I thought, spice it up a bit, do an Eastern Bloc unboxing. Surprise Shirts Co. seemed like the logical choice. I went with them and I'm really glad I went with them. I've I'm just blown away by how good the service has been. I definitely recommend you go and follow them on Twitter and buy a shirt because like it could come from any corner of the planet. You know, it could be a non-league shirt from England or it could be a second division shirt from Guatemala. You just don't know. It's been it's an absolutely amazing variety on show from what I've seen. So how this is going to work is one shirt is from the former Soviet Union and one shirt is from the former Yugoslavia. I don't know which one is which, which adds to the mystery. Now, it's quite appropriate that one of them is from the former Yugoslavia because I've got a FK Sloboda Tuzla um, shirt on from Bosnia, playing the Bosnian Premier League. So hopefully it's not a Sloboda Tuzla shirt. Um, we'll see. Um, yeah, really looking forward to this. So let's just get in about it. Let's get into the first box. So this is the first box here. If we can this tape off, oh, right, we're gonna go for the messy weight. Just as well these are gift wrapped. Um, so, ooh, I like the look of this. So we've got the first one here. Now, is this the Soviet Union or is it Yugoslavia? We will find out. So, got a little surprise here. Just uh, one about the sizing. So let's open it up. Very nice wrapping. So, oh, who is it? We're about to find out. It looks like it's got Cyrillic on it. I'm liking the look of this. I'm liking the look of this. Absolutely love it. A packet of Haribo's just fell out. So, I don't speak Russian or Serbian or whatever this is going to turn out to be. So I think we'll need to find um, the information card if they included one. This is a pretty smart shirt, as you can see here. I like the colours, now it's in Cyrillic, so could be from Serbia, to be fair, so we'll see, large, but it's, um, they said it could fit a medium, looks absolutely amazing, really smart, so there's it from the back, I'll show you the front again, this is a pretty cool shirt, and we've got a wee packet of Haribos as well, I like that, that's a nice touch, so yeah, really good shirt, now we don't know if this is Yugoslavia or the former Soviet Union, we'll need to see the, ah, the information sheet's in here. Vitebesk, who, if we have a look here, it's on the inside of the box. Vitebesk is from Belarus. Oh, it's the former Soviet Union shirt. So it's from Belarus. Now, I've messed that up. I've messed that up because I've wrecked the box. I wrecked the information thing. But this is Vitebesk from Bel well, 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 Belarus. I didn't expect that for the Soviet Union shirt. I was expecting CSK Moscow or something like that. Well, already they've pulled it out of the bag. That is absolutely amazing. So this is Vitebesk from Belarus. Now, if I get a little bit more information here, the, the country's fourth biggest club. This is Belarus's fourth biggest club. So they're basically like a Belarusian Aberdeen, effectively, in terms of like the third big, fourth biggest club in the league. Absolutely love this. Now, I do apologise for scarifying the information sheet a bit. I do realise I've not done this properly, but I'm absolutely amazed at this shirt. So this is the former Soviet Union shirt. So, da tovarisha. Um, this is the former Soviet Union shirt all the way from Belarus, Vitebsk. And I tell you what, Vitebsk, this is a nice shirt. I don't know how to say nice shirt in Belarusian or Russian, but yeah, this is absolutely uh, wow. Just, wow, I was not expecting that. This is unique. This is really unique. Like I said, I'll show you the back again. Nice colours. I really like that. Um, so, yeah, this is Vitebesk from Belarus, playing the Belarusian Premier League. 
And as it says there in the box, the fourth biggest club in the country. And I'm not too familiar with Belarusian football outside the Dynamo Mints, so it's good to get a shirt from outside the sort of big Belarusian team. So yeah, really, really love that. So that's the former Soviet Union out the way, all the way from the Belarusian Sovietsky Soyuz, the Belarusian Soviet Socialist Republic. Absolutely love this. So thank you to Mystery Shirts for that one. Absolutely love it. Plus the Haribos. Um, the shirt's better than the Haribos, obviously, but it's good to get Haribos. We get Vitebsk all the way from Belarusia. So we'll just get rid of that. And we'll get into our next shirt. So this time I'll try and like look at the information properly. Right. Oh, I've seen the name of the shirt, but I'm not going to tell you until we get out. I've seen the name of the team. Now, already through the wrapping, this is looking promising. I like it. Oh, oh, Tang Fastics. You know what? I, we don't need to see the shirt now, Tang Fastics. I'm kidding. Tang Fastics is absolutely brilliant. Now, Vita Best is already good, but this one, this one is looking smart. And it is HNK Rekia. Now, I did see this on the thing, and it's brand new and in the bag as well. It's brand new and in the bag, which is amazing. So, HNK Rekia. Now, I'm, I know Rekia. Or I, that's probably not how you pronounce it, but I know Rechia are from Croatia. I know that immediately. I don't know too much about them other than they're from the Croatia, but there we go. They're from Yugoslavia, and of course Croatia, one of Yugoslavia's bigger republics. A lot of Croatian teams are successful in the former Yugoslavia. So yeah, really, really happy with this. So HNK Rekia from Croatia. So I'm going to get out the bag now, just so we can get a proper look at it. We'll get this stuff out of the way. Now this is a nice shirt made by Joma as well. So um you know you know it's good stuff because um, they've made the hip shirt this year. So there we go. H N K Rekia from Croatia. So there's the back and there is the front. Now I'm really really liking this. Um so uh, a bit of Burnley-esque actually, but I'm really, really liking this. We'll get the tags out of the way so you can see the badge. But yeah, this is both are brand new with tags. This one's come in the box and it's got a nice it's got a nice Croatia flag on the back there as well. I really, really like that. And just wow. Just absolutely wow. Retchia and Vitebesk. So yeah, those are the shirts. Now I'll just tell you a bit about Retchia. Let me look at the what of left of what's left of the um information sheet. So they're from City in Croatia, they're completed in Croatia's top league, um, the club finished third place in the Croatian league last season, which is brilliant. I like, I love the information sheets as well, I think that's an excellent touch to tell you about the teams, despite the fact I destroyed them because my unboxing skills are still being refined. Me and Sellotape don't go well together, I think we've already learnt that lesson. So there we go, HNK Rekia, so I'll get that out of the way. And thank you for the Haribos as well. I really like, I really, I really love the Haribos. So, we'll just get another look at the Vitebesk shirt. Now, both of them are excellent, but I've got to say, because I've got a bit of a love affair with Belarus, I'm really interested in Belarus, the Vitebesk shirt's my favourite. Got to love the Rekia shirt as well. Um, so there you go, there is the Vitebesk shirt again. You can see that. Get round. Then we'll take another look at the Rekia shirt again. The back, so yeah, that is absolutely amazing. Now, I was not expecting shirts that unique. I was expecting a Red Star Belgrade or a CSK Moscow. I was not expecting shirts from Croatia and shirts from Belarus. And of course, yeah, Croatia's got Dinamo Zagreb, but yeah, I was expecting one of the big Serbian teams, the Yugoslavian ones. There you go, Soviet Union, Yugoslavia, Rekia and Vitebsk. So two new teams for me to follow and two new countries into the collection. I didn't have any um, Croatia or Belarus shirts before this video today. So two, two new countries into the collection, two new clubs. I'm really, really happy with that. So thank you so, so much to Surprise Shirt Co for making this possible. They have been absolutely amazing. I mean, that is amazing. How they source those, I don't know. I mean, you know, the effort that must go into sourcing those shirts is absolutely, you know, it must be immense. And plus, 
Thank you for the Haribos. I, I absolutely love those. Um, I love the shirts more, but Haribos are Haribos. So yeah, absolutely amazing. Um, I, I was not expecting that. I'm absolutely, I mean, as I always do in these unboxing videos, I think I'm waffling a bit. I'm waffling, but I'm, I'm stuck for words. I'm absolutely stuck for words. The, the, both those shirts are absolutely phenomenal. You know, they're, they're absolutely phenomenal. You just don't expect that um, sort of um, level of uniqueness when you do these mystery boxes. But yeah, absolutely amazing. So like I was saying at the start of the video, guys, surprise shirt code, that is what they're all about. Shirts that I, you just won't find in any other mystery boxes. And obviously, other mystery box companies are available, uh, but I'd surprise I definitely recommend Surprise Shirt Co because they have been excellent. Like I said, Belarus and a team that came fourth in the Croatian League. I mean, you're not going to get that anywhere else. That's unique. And like I said, people have been pulling shirts for Thailand, Africa, Central America, South America, sort of obscure places in Europe like I've done today. So I definitely recommend you get involved. You give them your money basically buy buy a shirt buy a box and you won't be disappointed it's been absolutely amazing plus you've got the haribos as well which is just an added bonus so yeah thank you so so much to surprise shirt co for making this video possible like i was saying i really enjoyed it got two excellent shirts in my collection really love those and as always, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a thumbs up. You know, that tells me you're enjoying the unboxings, which, trust me, there'll be more. There'll, there will be more. I mean, after that, because I'm a, it's more for me than it is for you, to be honest. Yeah, it, 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 there will be more unboxings. So leave a thumbs up to show your appreciation. And if you're new to the channel, please remember to subscribe for unique football and content. I'll be linking Surprise Shirt Co. down in the description so you can check them out. And all that's left for me to say is Das Vidanya Tavarasha, goodbye comrades, jack out.